hello pisces welcome to my channel my name is sally and this is going to be your love reading for the month of may 2022 this is going to be a collective energies from all those born under this zodiac sign of pisces sun moon rising or venus only take what applies to your situation and leave the rest for others if you are new here welcome if you are a returning subscriber welcome so pisces let's see what is in the cards for you holy spirit spirit of truth spirit of light Spirit of Wisdom, I welcome you here. Pisces, their love reading for the month of May 2022. Collective energies for Pisces, Holy Spirit. Their love reading for the month of May 2022. Pisces, love reading for the month of May 2022. Pisces. Pisces, love reading for the month of May 2022. Holy Spirit. Pisces love reading for the month of May 2022. For Pisces, their love reading for the month of May 2022. Holy Spirit for Pisces. Pisces love reading for the month of May 2022. Holy Spirit. Pisces. Pisces love reading for the month of May. 2022 holy spirit for pisces yeah love reading for the month of may 2022 for pisces okay pisces for pisces holy spirit all right okay at the top of your deck pisces you have um number 43 which is the um aisle card here the aisle that is a wedding aisle okay let's see what is in the rest of your oracle card you have the number 22 you have the number 20 you have the number 29 and you have the number nine okay let me move this so you can see clearly you raise the camera a bit Mm -hmm. all right let's see what is in your tarot cards holy spirit pisces they are love reading for the month of may 2022 Pisces love reading for the month of May 2022. Pisces. Pisces love reading for the month of May 2022. Pisces. They are love reading for the month of May 2022. For Pisces, Holy Spirit. Pisces, love reading for the month of May 2022. Pisces. Pisces, Holy Spirit. All right, let's see. You have the word. You have the Six of Wands. You have the Nine of Wands. You have the Queen of Swords. You have the Four of Cups. You have the Chariot. 
you have the king of pentacles you have the hierophant you have the queen of wands you have the eight of sword you have the justice and the ace, no, the magician. Sorry, this is the magician. Okay, this is my first time using this card. So, mm -hmm. at the top of your deck, you have the temperance. So, for the signs that you might be connecting to, we have um, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Cancer Pisces Scorpio, Taurus Virgo Capricorn. Yeah. We have the Queen and the King of Pentacles. Two plus two is four. So I see someone that wants to have stability with you, Pisces. I see that this person they wants to be um in a stable relationship with you. This is someone that wants to have a relationship with you. And there we have the eight of swords twice here. So I feel this is someone that is not free. If this person is not committed to someone else, if they are not in another relationship, then this is someone that is scared of commitment. They have commitment phobia. Mm -hmm. For some of you, this person could be at a distance from you. I see them thinking about you a lot here. This person could be sending you message. For some of you, I see lots and lots of communication between you and this person. I see a gift coming for some of your Pisces. Someone will be sending you a gift. They would. Mm. So this is someone that wants to bring balance into the situation here. They want to make things right with you. With the justice and um, the temperance here. That is telling me that this person, they want to balance things out with you. They want to do right by you. They want a relationship with you. They want something stable with you. With the word as your first cast and the magician there. Gemini energy coming through. This person is manifesting you. Mm. They are manifesting a new beginning with you. Like they fantasize about um, being in a relationship with you. Having a family with you a lot. Mm -hmm. So Pisces, I feel here that some of you here, you could be in a situation where you are not emotionally satisfied. Mm -hmm. With the four of cups here. I also feel someone feeling like they are missing out on a relationship with you. They are missing out on that emotional connection with you. Yeah. Someone wants to be successful with you. They want to have a successful um, relationship with you. For some of you, this person could be at a distance here. I see journey. I see travel. I see communication back and forth. But I also see fear of commitment heavily here, I feel. I see fear of commitment here. That's for some of you. Your person is scared of commitment. This could be someone that could have um, been committed in past. Maybe their past relationship did not go well. And they are scared of making the same mistakes. Mm. Yeah. This could be a third party situation for some of you. Mm -hmm. For some of you that are not together with this person, they kind of feel like you have moved on. They feel like you have moved on. But this is someone that have not moved away on from you. They have not moved on here. Like, they still check on you. Anonymously. Without you knowing. Like, go through your social media page. Look at old pictures of the both of you. Check if you are online. Check the last time you came online. Um, go back to um read the email, the message um that the both of you have shared with each other. So this person is someone that has not moved on, but they kind of feel like you have. Mm -hmm. Some of you, your person is thinking of marriage. A person is thinking of marriage here. They are thinking of commitment with you. They want to marry you. Yeah, they do. 
Hmm. Let's clarify to get more insight. Why is the word here for Pisces? Okay. We have the two of pentacles here. Someone here is feeling rejected by you. Or you could be feeling rejected by this person. Someone feel here like the other person is not so interested. But this is someone that wants to move forward with you. So there could be some kind of emotional imbalance in the situation where the both of you are not on the same page emotionally. One person could be feeling like they are more into the other person than the other person is into them. Let's see. Why is the six of wands here for Pisces, Holy Spirit? Why is the six of wands here for Pisces? We have here the dead. Yeah, someone wants to move a relationship forward with you. It could be a Scorpio. If things have ended between you and this person, they want you back. Why is the nine of wands here for Pisces, Holy Spirit? Why is the nine of wands here? We have here the Knight of Pentacles. Someone is still holding on to your energy. They are having a hard time moving on from uh, whatever that has happened here or moving on from you. Why is the Queen of Swords here for Pisces, Holy Spirit? Why is the Queen of Swords here? We have here the Wheel of Fortune. Yeah, someone here is thinking of changing the dynamic of things between the both of you. They want to bring balance into this relationship. They want to move things to the next level. Why is the Four of Cups here for Pisces, Holy Spirit? We have here the Two of Swords. So there could be no communication between you and your persons for some of you. The Two of Swords here. I see indecisiveness here as well in regards to the situation for some of you. I see. Why is the chariot here for Pisces, Holy Spirit? Why is the chariot here? Hmm. We have here the nine, which is the hermit. Yep. So someone at a distance is thinking about you. Seriously, this person could be having sleepless nights over you. They are looking at your pictures here. I feel like you inspire this person in a lot of ways here, Pisces. You do. This is someone that wants to move forward with you. They do. Mm. Why is the King of Pentacles here for Pisces, Holy Spirit? For some of you, I feel like finances could be a problem in this relationship here. Someone could be thinking of putting their money together before they could move a relationship forward with you. Someone here could be thinking of um paying for your trip to come see them. Like paying for you, your flight, um, your bus ticket to come see them. So someone is like putting money aside for that. Why is the King of Pentacles here for Pisces? Okay, we have here the Empress. Yeah, someone here is seeing you as the Empress here. This person do wants to be with you. Yeah. They do want to be with you. They do. I see. Why is the Hierophant here for Pisces, Holy Spirit? Why is the Hierophant here for Pisces? We have here the Five of Wands. Someone here is conflicted. Should I move this forward? Is it too early? Am I rushing this? I need to slow down. Mm -hmm. Someone is very anxious here in regards to commitment. They are very, very anxious. They are. They are very anxious. There is a lot of fear in this person's mind. They could be afraid that they are moving things too fast. They could be afraid that they are not doing the right thing. They could be afraid that they are not thinking straight. They could be afraid that they are being too obsessive with this situation with you. That is for some of you. Hmm. And for those of you that are not in communication with this person, like I said before, they are thinking about you. They are. They miss you. Why is the Queen of Wands here for Pisces? 
Mm. We have the Five of Sword. Yeah. Reminiscing on past year. There is anger here. There is pain here in the situation here. A signed person. This person could be confused on what to do with this relationship. Mm hmm. Hmm. I feel like for some of you, this is someone that was offering you breadcrumbs in the past. They were not giving you um something stable in this relationship in the past. Hmm. Let's see. Why is the Ace of Sword here for Pisces? Holy Spirit. Hmm. We have the Queen of Cups. Someone here is scared of their feelings for you, Pisces. Mm -hmm. And we have here the lovers. Yeah, this person truly loves you. They do. They love you and they are scared of what they feel for you. And they are scared. For some of them, they could be scared that they are rushing things with you. Gemini energy, water sign energy coming through there. Why is the justice here for Pisces, Holy Spirit? We have the Eight of Wands here. Communication in regards to marriage here. Let's see. Why is the uh, magician here for Pisces? Why is the magician here for Pisces? Why is the magician here? We have here the Six of Pentacles. Yeah. This is someone that wants to give to you. I see the need for balance here. This could be emotional balance here between you and this person. We have the Ten of Wands here. We have the Seven of Wands here. Someone here is tired of holding back from you. They are tired of holding back their feelings here. They are tired of holding back their tongue from saying what they want to say. Mm -hmm. They are just so tired of doing that here. Hmm. We have the seven. I keep seeing the seven of pentacles. I keep seeing the seven of pentacles in your reading, Pisces. Anytime I shuffle to clarify a card, the seven of pentacles come up at the top. Hmm. Someone here wants to come to you. They do want to come to you. They do. I feel for some of you, this could be someone from your past. Could be an air sign person or a fire sign person. It doesn't have to be. But I feel like um, Pisces, some of you could have option in love. You could have option. There could be a fire sign involved here that wants to be with you. Someone desperately wants to marry you. They don't want to marry you. I see a shocking offer that would be coming to you, Pisces. Mm -hmm. A shocking offer will be coming. An offer you are not expecting. Could be an offer of a relationship. An offer to move in together. Hmm. I see someone here being very jealous and envious of you. Like, they kind of feel like you're moving away. They feel like you've moved on. This could be past person. Like, they're scared that you've moved on. Someone in the background is jealous. Someone is jealous of you. They could be jealous of how quick you can move on. Mm. Or they could be... This person is someone that doesn't want to see you with someone else. They don't. They don't want you to be with someone else. They don't want someone else to have you. They want to be the one and only person in your life. But I feel this is someone that has not treated you right. For some of you, this person has not treated you right. Hmm. We have the page of cups. Yeah, they are coming to make you an offer. Some of you could be connected to someone younger. Could be connecting to someone younger. The page of sword. I see communication from this person. This person could be emotionally immature. Yeah. They don't want you to be with someone else. This is someone that doesn't want you to be with someone else, Pisces. They don't. They don't want you to be with someone else. All right, Pisces, thank you guys for your love and support. Personal reading, personal guidance information for that will be in the description box. Um, do not forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to leave a comment to let me know how you feel. I will see you in my next video. Bye and take care.